welcome back to my channel. I have a special guest with me here today. He's appeared on the vlog many a time before, but if you haven't met, this is my fiance, the one and only Country Colt. <laughs> <laughs> Today's vlog is going to be so much fun because we decided that we're going to make little festive Halloween fall goodie baskets for all of our neighbors. I don't know if you could hear, but our dogs are really naughty. <laughs> They're not really, but sometimes they can be really rambunctious and they like to run around and bark and cause a ruckus and we do live in like a townhome condo type of situation so we share walls with the neighbors. Floor. They can definitely hear our dogs and we feel like they're probably pretty annoying sometimes. So we want to give them a little fall basket to thank them for being good neighbors and tolerating our naughty dogs. <laughs> we actually got a special delivery in the mail today from a company called Love Pop. They make tons of cool like pop-up cards and you might be like okay a pop-up card cool but these are actually really extravagant pop-up cards and they sent us a package and um, let us preview some of their new fall items from their Disney collection and they're so cute okay let's show them I'm not gonna open it yet I'll show you guys the inside later but um you open these cards and it unfolds like this crazy scene from your favorite Disney film. So I think we got Nightmare Before Christmas, we got Haunted Mansion, and then they sent us, oh, this one's so cute. I didn't even look at it yet. This one is the Hocus Pocus one. But anyway, we're gonna go shopping, pick up some fun stuff to put in a little Halloween goodie basket. We're gonna make some little treats. And then not only are we gonna deliver to our surrounding neighbors, but there is the sweetest older gentleman. Do you remember his name? No. It's this really adorable uh, older gentleman who loves to say hi to us when we go out and walk our doggies and he's always ready to strike up a conversation and he's just so sweet. So we're gonna bring one to him too. Let's jump in the car, go pick out the goodies and then come back and put them together. Let's do it! By the way, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel for a new video every single Friday and before I forget to tell you, it's a good day to have a good day. So let's have a good day. And I just kind of wanted to quick brainstorm some ideas for our basket. So we've got the love pop cards. Kit Kats. <laughs> Why Kit Kats? So I can have some. That is not very like nice neighborly. That's selfish. <laughs> <laughs> let's keep thinking. I think candy for sure. But do people really love Kit Kats that much? Yes, it's like Besides the go-to. Besides you. It's the go-to. That's nobody's go-to. Go-to. My go-to candy bar would be a Reese's or a Snickers. I would never, ever, ever, ever pick out a Kit Kat. Ever. Ever. <laughs> I feel like you're the kind of guy that would get a Crunch Bar. I used to love the Crunch Bar. Ew. Uh, literally the worst candy bar to ever exist. So besides Candy. We've got the love pop cards and actually just yesterday I was at Target um, picking up some cleaning supplies and I found a bunch of little um, pumpkin spice and pumpkin shortbread candles. They were like little baby ones and I was going to put them all over our house but I got four of them and now I'm just like it would be way more fun to give them away. So, <laughs> I think we're gonna put those in their baskets. We gotta check out the Target dollar spot because that's always full of fun holiday stuff. I think we're gonna get like pre-made Halloween cookies. Have you had those ones that are shaped like a pumpkin? Uh, They're just like sugar cookies from Pillsbury that you put in the oven. I feel like they would be right up your alley. I do like sugar cookies. You can sneak one of those. Then we gotta get a basket too. Let's not forget to get baskets because I can see us doing that. But I think it's going to be really cute and really fun and as you can see it's kind of getting dark out so it's pretty late and I'm hoping that we can like sneak these outside their door when they least expect it. So they'll be really surprised when they get up in the morning with their cute little baskets.
honestly, Target dollar section is pretty picked over, but they have cute bandanas for our dogs. <laughs> we found some baskets. I like the black ones the best. There's only three of them. Well then, somebody gets a different one. I really don't like that one. That's pretty cute. <laughs> That's pretty cute though. We could do one orange and three black. We're gonna try and find a cute mug for everyone. I would prefer festive, but you know what? We'll take what we can get. Boo. Haha, <laughs> oh those are cute. Wait, 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 wait. The old guy has a squirrel on his porch. We should get him this one. <laughs> Get this boo sweater for our dogs. Look at these. They're sticky hands, but they look like chicken claws. <laughs> Don't you think? That looks like a Are chicken they? claw. I think it's supposed to be a skeleton hand. <laughs> <laughs> Do you love or hate candy corn? Hate. Oh, I also hate it. Disgusting. Do you guys like it? It's upside down, but it should be. It's dirt. <laughs> Are you excited to see what we got the neighbors? Oh, you are, aren't ya? Alrighty, we are home. We got the goods. Thomas, <laughs> get off. Naughty! Why are you such a little monster? <laughs> Crazy. <laughs> While we're putting the baskets together, I think I'm gonna pop the Pillsbury pumpkin sugar cookies into the oven. It looks like you just have to put them in for like 10 minutes, so it won't take long. But I'm gonna preheat the oven quick and then we will show you everything that we picked up. Just call me Rachel Ray. <laughs> I think I'm gonna cut this mask out for Colton to wear while we do our activity. <laughs> what do you think? Love it. <laughs> I thought you were kidding. <laughs> Before we throw these together, let me show you what we ended up picking out. So of course we had to get these dang Kit Kats. And then um, we got these little decorative mini pumpkins. We're gonna put a couple of them in each of the baskets. I think they're really cute and would look adorable in people's houses, just mix in with their fall decorations. We decided to get these little guys instead of those plasticky looking white and black pumpkins that we showed you in Target, just because we could only find two of them and I actually think these are a lot cuter anyway, so. Got these. For our cookies that are in the oven, we just got these little boo Ziploc baggies to pop them in. We got cute little kitchen towels for everybody's houses. There's a spider one, a spider web one, which is way cute. There's this witch one that says Happy Halloween. And my dog likes that one the best, apparently. And then just this black and white and pink and blue star pattern one. All really cute and fun. These are the candles that I was talking about that I actually picked up the other day, just in different pumpkin-y scents. There's Heritage Pumpkin, which is this 
pumpkin orange color and then I have two of these pumpkin short red ones and Take a sniff. Ah, spicy. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh my god. Um, we have actually just we need to pause for a moment. Somebody actually just got here and they just want to say hey. Um, so I'm gonna introduce you. Come on over. All hail the pumpkin king. <laughs> Wait, come back. Wow, that looks amazing on you. I'm glad that we had some twine for you to tie that around your head. That really makes your eyes pop. We should wear that on our wedding day. Yeah. Got these caramel apple pops. I honestly pulled a Colton and got these mostly for myself. Last but not least, here are the mugs that we ended up picking out. This one is going to our um, old friend. <laughs> I feel bad calling him that. Our not next door neighbor who has squirrels on his um, patio. So I think he's gonna love this. It's precious. I love it. I kind of want to keep all of these, but I won't. We got one that says happy fall, y'all. This is really cute. And then one that is a pumpkin with a handle. Love it. And the last one that we got is just this white one that says, boom. Really cute. Love them all. And then you guys already kind of saw the baskets. We only got one of this lantern guy. And then the rest are these black trick or treat ones. You ready? Where'd the pumpkin king go? I don't see him. All right, we're gonna show you guys these Love Pop pop-up cards. I'm actually really excited to see them myself. I had honestly not heard of Love Pop previously, but Colton saw them on Shark Tank, right? Yep. And he said their stuff is really cool, so. I am excited! Okay, this is the Hocus Pocus one. On the front it says, I put a spell on you. Oh, here we go. <gasps> oh my God! Too darn cute. Look! <laughs> Their little bubbling brewing pot. It says pull for note. Oh, oh, that's really nice. Okay, so then you can pull out this card and that's where you write your personalized note to whoever you're giving this to. <gasps> that is cute. This one is the Nightmare Before Christmas, which I feel like is a big crowd favorite. So I'm sure this one's popular. Here's the front of this one. The little nightmare classic scenery. And then, how cute. Oh my gosh, these are actually so adorable. And the cute little details, I mean, come on now. This is Haunted Mansion. Spooky little design on the front. Oh wow. This is so cute. Uh, I love these. These are real cute for my Disney love and soul. Did you see the oh, no, I didn't. It's got like the Haunted Mansion wallpaper on the back side. We have one more thing from Love Pop that we didn't show you guys before. As you can see, it's a much larger package and I'm really excited to pull it out. This is also um, one of their Nightmare Before Christmas designs. It's called the Seriously Spooky Bouquet. And if you have somebody that you love, that you want to surprise on <laughs> Halloween, this is the one. This is the one. Okay. Wow. This is large and in charge. Okay. Here it is, not popped. This is crazy. Okay, slide up from the vase to remove. Squeeze the decide. Squeeze the decides. Squeeze the sides to pop it open. <gasps> oh my gosh! How cute! It's like a vase full of spooky flowers, and it's got 
Jack in there and the vase actually has his bow tie on it. Oh me oh my. This is very fun. Where's the bow tie? Right there. Oh. On the front. <laughs> so cute. I think in everybody's notes we're gonna put a little picture of Thomas and Eddie so that they know which neighborhood doggies this gift is from. <laughs> There's quite a few. Do I look good? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Who do you think wore it better, you or me? I did. <laughs> what the heck? It's not a very nice thing to say to your future <laughs> wife. We're gonna start assembly. I think I wanna just begin by filling them all with a little bit of tissue paper. We just have plain white tissue paper. And then we're just gonna have to play around, see what looks cute, and kind of go from there. But here goes it. at the bottom to kind of give it some height and then put everything on top. That'll look a lot nicer. You're doing great, Country Colt. The neighbors are gonna love it. That's good. You're gonna be like, Whoa, the Pumpkin King made me my own basket? You'd be like, Pumpkin King, let's see. <laughs> I remembered we had extra fall confetti from our Magic Factory fall restock sale, so I'm gonna sprinkle some on top of all of their little baskets. I feel like the fall fairy. Tra-la-la. -la. <gasps> Oops. <laughs> Just a pop. <laughs> our baskets are almost Complete. Last two things we need to do are write our little notes on their Love Pop cards and put them in here and then we also need to bag up the cookies. I think we need to wait a couple more minutes because they're still probably pretty hot. Oh, but then we'll bag them up, pop them in, and then drop them off at people's doors. I'm so excited. It's going to be kind of awkward if they like <laughs> pop their head out and they're like, what the what heck are you doing? <laughs> And then you're gonna be like, I'm the pumpkin king and I'm here to spread fall cheer. And I'm gonna say, I'm the fall fairy and I'm here to spread fall magic. And they're gonna be like, yo, we're calling cops. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get out of here. <laughs> 
well friends, that wraps up today's vlog. I'm really hoping that all of our neighbors enjoy their baskets and thank you guys so much for tagging along and making them with us. It was a ton of fun and I really encourage you to find somebody to do something nice and special for this fall. It was so, so fun. And um, Thomas just wants to say goodbye, don't ya? Have a good day, I love you guys. Mwah.